so guys so it's been said that you should ask and you shall receive so I asked and I received so let's go check them out and see what Timu has actually sent us this time around. This is what my third Timu haul sponsored. The first one was sponsored by Mua Hair, <laughs> and I think you guys like that one most of all. But they're all Timu, so let's go check it out and see what fabulous goodies I have to share with you guys. As I always say, I'm such an idiot. <laughs> Okay guys, so let me tell you all the great deals and benefits you're going to be getting once you shop with Timu. The first thing you need to do is download the app. Now why do I say this? I tell you this because it's easier for you to get your discounts. What tends to happen is when you download the app, okay, and you put items in your cart, Timu will literally tell you, hey, you can save some more money because this item has gone down in price and so you have more money to spend that way you're saving okay you get 90 percent of savings on your items great prices affordable prices quality items and i'm not just saying that i am telling you the truth because this is an honest review and i have ordered timu items for myself from my own money so i know i ain't talking no crap to you all right okay what i would also say is that their delivery is very good you get a tracking once you have placed your order and you are kept up to date to where your order is i will put a coupon for you right here right here right here a hundred dollars worth of coupon bundle off of your money 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 okay also you have free shipping and also there's a 90-day return now whoever told who, have you ever heard of a 90-day return that is unbelievable okay there's another thing i wanted to tell you oh yes one more i think there's two more actually that i need to tell you that's really really important they actually credit your account. So if you return something or something is broken, they credit your account. I think that's really, really, really good. I know Amazon don't do that. <laughs> that's what I do know. Okay. Um, another thing as well, you use all the usual pay later sort of payment system out there. So Klarna, Afterpay, they also accept that. And also all the major credit cards. Okay, guys. And I think they use PayPal as well because I did use PayPal when I when I um did my first order, I actually paid with PayPal. Okay, so it's a really really one stop shop for everything. I thought it was something I was looking for the other day, and I thought I thought to myself, should I just put it into Timu and see if they had it? And I was totally surprised it actually popped up and a wide variety. I can't remember what the item was, but Timu is literally a one stop shop for everything. I remember it was a coffee machine. I was like, do they sell coffee machines? Nah. Yeah, they do. <laughs> I was like, this is unbelievable. Anyway, guys. So let's check out these packages that I have here. This is a small one. I don't know what's actually in them. When I requested it, it was ages ago. And as I said to you, team just kept me up to date and when it's actually going to be delivered and you have to sign for it as well. And if you're not home, it's taken to your local post office where you have to go and present ID to get it. So that's really important. What I like is that they don't leave it outside the door and just drive away. It must be kept securely for the customer. Okay, guys. So let's go check out these items and um, let's see what they have sent us over. And guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, just subscribe. It's really easy. There's a little bell button that says subscribe and click it. And then <gasps> you've done it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming up to 10,000 subscribers guys. I really want to share my Timu items with you. I've got a few of them I'd like to give away to my fantastic subscribers because you guys make this channel possible. So love you lots. Let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. <laughs> All right guys, so let's open this up and see what's in here. I think we'll start with the smaller package first and see what's in it. 
I love actually opening up the items with you guys because then you can actually hear how well surprised I am. Oh, look at that. We've got a packaging within a packaging. Well done, team. Ooh, this is fantastic. Oh, this is so good. So they're really listening to us when we say we want the packaging a lot more better. So we get another Ziploc bag here. And this is brilliant. Really pleased with it. I love the bag, though. You can definitely reuse this again. Guys, you can even use it for quilting. You can put your quilting items in here, your fabrics in here, or even a quilt that you have not quilted as yet. You can fold it and reuse your bag. So thank you, Timu. I really appreciate that. Okay, so, oh, this is lovely. Let's see what these items are. It's a cordless hair straightener. <laughs> okay, I remember requesting this. Again, guys, I will put all the details for you on the screen. This is a beaut. Oh my God, this is lovely. I love the fact that it's cordless. So it's charged. You plug it in and you charge it. Look at the little socket there. Ah. I'm gonna to have to try this and I'll plug it in and make sure it actually works. That's what's in here. Okay, so this, okay. You know what guys, let's do this right now. I am next to my laptop. So let's plug it in and see if it comes on. If it doesn't work, I'll be so blooming disappointed. I really would. Okay, so it fits in there nicely. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, what is this? Okay, it's a nice little pouch. Oh, that's cute. Okay, let us plug this in and see. I'm going to put it on top of the pouch because I don't want it to ruin my table. Right, let's plug it in. All right, so, oh, it lights up. Look, look, it lights up. Okay. All right, what is, so. I'm quiet because I'm looking at it. <laughs> it's really nice and handy in my hand, though. I must admit, it looks, it has a nice weight to it. All right, so open. Oh, this button's here. Oh! <laughs> So this little lock here means that you can close it and when I press it on the open side, it opens it. So I'll do this again. So that's open. If I turn it over, press it. Am I pressing it? Okay, yeah. And it closes. Oh, excellent. Right, so you have a temperature gauge there. So I don't know if you can make it out. It says 170 and 20. Hmm. Right, so I want to know if it actually heats up to what it says. So we'll give it a minute and come back to it and see if it actually heats up nicely. Right, does it have any instructions? I'm going to put it right on top there. Oh, it does. Excellent, it does. Let's have a quick snooze of this and see. So on off button, button plus and button for temperature adjustment. What is that? Number two. I thought as much. So this button here is to adjust the temperature. My issues, I want to know temperature indicator light for um, straightening plates, button safety lock, USB connection charge. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to leave it there to heat up for a few minutes and then I will come back to it. So I'm just going to put it to the side for now. Then we'll come back to it and see what it's like. Oh, okay. Right, what's in this box now? Let's have a look. That straightener really impressed me, actually. I'm still thinking about it while I'm opening this. Okay, so what is this? Oh, it's a little scissors. Beautiful box, isn't it? This would be nice to give us a present. 
to one of you beautiful people out there. Oh, that's so cute! Oh my gosh, just what a beautiful present for somebody who actually does sewing. Oh my god, you got a little timble there as well. Look at the scissors. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. What a beautiful little present. I love the presentation box as well. Really nice. I'm going to put it back in. That's beautiful. That's really beautiful. Let's look at it again. That's really nice, guys, isn't it? Beautiful little present for somebody who loves crafting. Right, and you get... A little tassel for it. I won't open it because, as I said, I want to bless one of my subscribers with this. Absolutely beautiful. Right, guys, that's my husband calling. I'll be back with you in a second. Hi, sweetie. All right, guys, so let's open up the bigger bag and see what's in here. So once again, it is wrapped up as you would normally when you get your tea move bags. I do feel though that one of the reasons that the bags are sort of packed this way, I think is when it goes through customs. I think possibly they open it up if you've like, ordered sharp items. So I think that's one of the reasons what that ha why that happens. Why the bag looks like, you know, it's been been through a trauma I think at all the taping but at the end of the day as long as the items are protected that's the most important thing I'm just using my scissors here to clip through the orange bag sorry for the noise you know I'm very noisy doing this already All right here we go we have lift off I can see again that there is the packaging inside the white bag. Put that down there. Oh, so they're all all of them. So they have four bags inside that they put for me, and really good that they have actually individually packed all of the items into these bags which is really good um, so I'm happy with that all right so let's start with the smaller ones first I'll move two aside really happy with these bags and as I said guys you can reuse them there's no point not reusing them is it so it's really good okay Right, so I'm going to move this one to the side because I don't want to obscure your view. Okay, so I'm going to put that bag down there. All right, so this one, and I ordered or requested a soap dish as well. And the strange thing is I don't really use much soap dishes in my um, home here. I tend to use... Um, I tend to use, you know, the little bottles of the soap that you have to pump. Okay, but this is a soap jar here. But I like this for the reason being that you can use it in the shower and you can press your items on top of, of it or you put your soap there. I also like the water spout. One of the reasons I got this was to do with... Um, for the caravan because we have a, tra a caravan and we did travel around Australia and I thought this would be really nice and suited in the caravan so I thought that was really ideal I will put a picture on the screen as I usually do another makeup brush which is really nice I did have a black one I did request a black one but I tried thought I'll try a blue one now and um, this is I wouldn't say it's a makeup brush as such but what it is is a sponge applicator for your foundation I did try the black one and it was nice and uh, it's nice and soft. I'll take it out of the packaging. Nice and soft and uh, it does the job really well. Love the handle so your fingers don't get mucky with the, um, the you know, the sponges they have now where you've got to use a sponge to 
dab all over your face but because you have this handle here you don't get doesn't get mucky so that's pretty good right let's look at this oh pretty cool okay let me try and open this up and must admit that they they wrap it up so nicely for you <laughs> that is well much in there okay oh <laughs> Now this is something you can actually do with your grandchildren, granddaughters, or give them, give them a task. And when they come over, they have something to keep them busy. Because what I do find sometimes is that um, young children don't have enough items to actually stretch their minds and get them really thinking. And so this is a sort of a craft picture. And what you do, you get all the colors of the beads that you literally have to sit down and place on each of the items of the colors of the pictures. Really gives you all the instructions. It tells you which color goes in what areas. And you've got all of the colors here as well. So as you can see, this is a really beautiful project, as I said. To sit with your grandchildren and do, especially girls, they would love a project like this. You've got a little tray to put all the beads in and you've got a pen for which they applicate. So even for yourself, and once it's done, you can actually frame it. But I just find that it's something really beautiful you can spend time with your grandchildren doing. So as I said, it gives you all the instructions and the picture is of a sewing machine Yay! <laughs> you know how beautiful of that something to do with your granddaughter or grandson and give them the picture in the end or have it over your house whereby and the, the little paper comes off so you can get started and, and it's sticky so it sticks onto it all right but i wouldn't take it off now and leave it on there because i don't want to ruin it but that's, that's a beautiful project, absolutely project, beautiful. Once it's done, you can frame it, can you? Because all the stones stick on there, they look really beautiful in the frame. And the colors of all of the little stones here is so vibrant and bright. So you can be able to see it through in the frame. I don't want to take it out because obviously I don't want to spill it, but yeah absolutely gorgeous really really nice i'll put a picture up as well so that you can see what it looks like but that's a really nice project for a family to do together granddaughter and grandmother or sisters really lovely crafting project so let's put that to the side all right let's open the other smaller bag which i think is this one here oh i ordered two excellent so Let's see what the other one is. Beautiful crafting things, isn't it? I, thought, I just love crafting. It's, it's so, it is such a peaceful moment that you are in your own little zone and you can carry on doing what you want to do. Let's look at this one. Love this. So beautiful. As I said, Timu is really a one-stop shop. It really, really is. I mean, un oh, love this one. This love it. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah, I'll tell you what it actually says. It says, because someone we love is in heaven, there is a little bit of heaven in our home. What a beautiful saying. Isn't that lovely? absolutely gorgeous i wonder what made me got this i can only think of when i actually saw it i was thinking of my sister because for those of you who've been following me for a long time you'd know that my sister passed and she was only literally just turned 40 and she not too long had twins so it was a really difficult time for me so I can only imagine as to why, and she always used to, as soon as the video went out, she always used to be the first person to make a comment. Um, and I do remember that when I posted the first video after she died, um, 
I, I sillily sort of was in anticipation looking for a comment from her, knowing very well it wouldn't happen. But yeah, it's, it's the absence, isn't it? So I can only imagine that's um, why I got this. So this is nice and personal to me. So um, this is something I would probably do. Just again, that crafting peaceful moment to um, complete at a pace whereby you will feel so delighted once it's done. And again, let me show you the stones with all the different colors it comes with. Absolutely gorgeous. Love that. And again, you get your tray and everything else to complete the application. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. I'll put that one aside. Okay, so this one, let's look at this. Oh, I can see what this is. I saw this and um, when I saw it, I thought this would be beautiful for quilting. I love the way that they have packaged it. Packaged it. <laughs> Where did that word come from? Packaged. It's wrapped beautifully so that it doesn't get damaged. And, you know, for me, that's important because I don't want when I ask for something or request something that it comes broken. It's a bit of a disappointment. But I haven't got that experience today. <laughs> right, guys. Oh my God, Karen, honestly, you are the worst person for opening things. So in case you're wondering what it is, it's absolute, it's rulers. So I remember seeing this and I thought this is absolutely gorgeous. It is a double wedding ring and I have to definitely look at the price to tell you this right now. So let me see if I have it in my, <laughs> I'm laughing. Do you know why I'm laughing guys? Because I tend to have things in my shopping cart on my Timu app. So I tend to, <laughs> Oh, Karen, you are terrible. So I tend to, uh, yeah, just look at it very quickly. So I put items in my shopping cart, the things I'm planning to order. Right, so I think it was then I did take it out because it was out of stock. So obviously I have it here today. So let me Google it very quickly. Not Google, let me search for it very quickly and see if it comes up. Right, double... ring quilt there it is right let's have a look and see let's open it up so this is 1898 and my god as, as I'm looking at it now <coughs> it is actually 480 persons have actually bought this. Look at it. Oh my gosh. So it's a double wedding ring quilting template set and it comes in at $18.98. This is so expensive for those of you who are just as shocked as I am. This is so expensive to buy in the local quilt stores. And I'm just so amazed. <laughs> yeah, sometimes the things on Timo really surprise me. And when I searched for this, I just randomly, I thought, let me see if they have, because I love doing that to Timo. Let me see if they have this. And I'm always pleasantly surprised that they have the items that I'm thinking about. It is just so freaking unbelievable. Freaking unbelievable. So that it obviously gives you instructions how to use it. So this is, this is it here guys. Look at that. This is so expensive. <laughs> so expensive in the quilt store. So I'm telling you, low, no lie, no lie, no lie, no lie, no lie. This is unbelievably expensive in the quilt store. I mean, I I don't even know what the price it comes out as, but I know that when I wanted was to buy one, it was yeah a bit pricey, and I thought, nah, I don't necessarily need this right now. 
and now it is only $18.98 on Timu. I'm, 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 yeah, I'm kind of, um, <laughs> I'm kind of surprised. And the thing is, you can use it for other items as well, for other quilting. You don't have to definitely use it as like that, you know, and straighten up the edges. You don't have to use it like that. You can use just these two and do the other side. Oh my God, I cannot wait to show you how I'm going to use this. So it is just like any other. I know some of you is going to say to me, is it, does it have all the proper measurements and then the markings? You have all the markings. Definitely everything is there. It actually tells you how to formulate it as well. Look, guys, this is unbelievable. Look. This is, this is, this is crazy this is crazy so they're all labeled a b c d and e because obviously you've got five pieces yeah i just want to make sure you see in the camera shot so you can see who we uh yeah 1898 this is a uh, i'm sorry i'm a little bit stalling on this but it's just so yeah Okay, all right. I'm I'm gonna put this aside and um, I'm gonna. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Thank you, Timu. This is beautiful. This is really, really beautiful. This is yeah. This is this is ah. Uh, I, I <laughs> the rulers. The rulers alone from Timu is is such a bargain. Timu, never raise your prices, please. Don't do it really don't do it just just don't 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 do it don't do it right another bag again that's packed really beautifully i love the fact that they keep giving us these plastic bags oh my god right here we go and this one has fabric oh i have another one of these so okay we'll put that aside different color it'll be fantastic in my caravan oh what is this in here and what are these all right so let us open oh these are beautiful let us open these items well this i don't know what this um all i have to do is simply is open it up i keep feeling and feeling right i don't because i'm just so careful as i don't want to ruin anything right i'm gonna find a side where it has not oh i can see a little no 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 just cut it open just i'm gonna do a little skimmer oh it's a little scissors <laughs> beautiful look at that now Guys, if you've been following the channel and all of my Timu on packaging, you know that I love scissors. I love all these little snippet scissors. And I've, I, the last one I did from Timu, have I got it right in front of me? Um, it was, I fell in love with it. And um, I, I thought it was one of the most beautiful little things I actually seen. So I got another different type. So this is the first one. Okay, it's so gorgeous. <laughs> so I couldn't help myself to get this one and see what it looks like. So this is exactly the same ones that I use on a regular basis. So, and I do have a combination of different colors, but this is my one and this is Timu's. Look at it, absolutely the same, the same little snippets. And is obviously is the bird. So I'll hold it that way so you can see it. Yeah. Ah, oh, they're beautiful. I love, love, love the color. Absolutely gorgeous. So pretty. I just love this. I have. <laughs> I love these little scissors. They're so beautiful. I'll show you another one. I have my one here. So just so that you see, it's the exact same thing so amazing 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 i wonder what it actually costs let me quickly have a look and see okay 
So while that's coming up, okay, so I'll put that to the side. My table is getting busy. And I love the way it came in. And I think that's one of the reasons, as I said before, um, with um, the fact that when your bags are taped around, I don't think they're taped around like that when they leave um, Timu's. I think they're taped around like that, especially if you have ordered items such as what I have ordered. So I ordered scissors and stuff like that. They obviously it will be checked. So that's why the bags come like that. Okay, so let's look at this fabric here. Now, again, if you've been following me, you would know that I, this is the third time that I have actually looked at a fourth time Timu's fabrics. Oh, wow. So this is what size? This is fat quarters here. I'm trying to make myself some room. So these are fat quarters. Let's turn it over on this side. And they feel like cotton and they're not thin. So I can lift it up and you can see it's good, good quality. You can see. So it's a combination of different blues. So you have that one there. That one. I'm looking at the flowers to see how different they are. Oh, I love this one. That's pretty. How many do you get? One, two, three, four, five, six. Not bad. Not bad at all. Nice. I can't see anything else <laughs> more than it's nice. It, it feels good. It is not thin. It feels like any other cotton that I would use normally. I mean, let me pick up a piece of my cotton here and it feels the same. So yeah, this would be a nice to use a combination of different fabrics that you have in your collection already. So let's look at this one now. So these are the Japanese prints and from my last team haul I did order some Japanese prints and I have actually started a quilt with them and I'll just show you a little bit of them here so these were the general strips and oh my god so look at that they are absolutely gorgeous aren't they I'll put them on the side for a minute so these again are from Timu so I am going to use these in this particular quilt so let's look at these ones here and see. So this is gorgeous. Oh my God, you cannot help but fall in love with these blooming fabrics. Beautiful, absolutely be. Oh my God, look at this one. And it's so thick. Look, look, it's so thick. Oh, wow. Love that, absolutely gorgeous. Again, I love blue. So if you're thinking, oh, there's a lot of blues she's asked for. Yeah, it, blue is my favorite color. Any shade of blue is my favorite color. Look at that one. It looks like um, little gold swells in it. Absolutely gorgeous. Really, really nice. And again, you hear that? That's good quality fabric there. And I know a lot of you are very critical. Like, oh, it's cheap. No, it's not. It really is good. Really good quad. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at that. How can you not fall in love with this? That's what it looks like at the back. Really beautiful, guys. Oh. Right, let's move on to this now. I just had a, 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 a brain um, memory as to what these are. These are sewing machine needle threaders. So when you want to... <laughs> Because you know I wear glasses, right? And I'm as blind as a bat. You know what? I never used to be this blind, you know. Teaching. Teaching has caused me to be blind because you tend to be on computers and screens a lot. So it's really caused me to lose a lot of my sight when it comes to stuff. So tiny little holes like a needle, but this was going to help me. So I thought I'll try them out. So on my next, it's got a little, I don't know if you can see, it's got a little hook there probably wouldn't be able to see it just right there um, to help you thread the needle so 
On my next sewing or quilting video, I will definitely demonstrate how to use that. But these fabrics are amazing. Let's let's do that test with one of these ones so, um, so you guys are confident in what I'm saying. Again, beautiful, nice snapback with the fabric. Lovely. Very good. And in case you're wondering, that's one of the ways to actually tell if you are on the right grain for cutting. You get that nice snap back. Okay, so let's open up this little garland here. It's burgundy and it's just a lace garland. I can only imagine it's probably a meter. And again, I usually use these things on my crafting items. So this is a beautiful color. Let me get an example. So I'm going to stop for a second and get an example and show you of how I actually use it. I'm going to get one of my craft bags and bring them out here and show you how I use it. So give me a sec. All right, guys. So as I was saying about the ribbons, let me show you how I use it. Now, I was looking at the ribbons actually before I came back on. And this is two yards. And I think they come in at 198. This is really lovely. But let me show you how I use the ribbons. So this is one of my bags that I actually sell. And you can see I usually use the ribbons in in reference to how you would do a patchwork anyway. Okay. So these are all ribbons here. As you can see, I've even put some along there and make it into a grid. I also use it like little tassels as well on there and the back is plain so i use lace at the back <coughs> excuse me and um that's how i do the front so really lovely and these sell really nicely and they're unique and different okay um i also use my little handmade as well on the side there another way i actually use it is on items like these again as a little tassel there and i tend to sew them together with um, other ribbons so I have another set of ribbons to show you here that Timu has sent me and these ones here are really beautiful as well so they are really versatile for your crafting you don't have to you, you listen guys if you want to put your ribbons on any blooming thing that you so desire you can what I like about crafting is that Every crafter is unique and so everybody do things differently and these are all the things that makes your crafting unique when you go to your craft stores to sell your items. So look at these ones here. Really lovely. Let me take them all out and show you at least some of it anyway. Different variety of how they look. Really, really pretty. Imagine that on your crafting items, how beautiful it would look. And again, I always like to bring children involved because I think when children get involved in crafting, because obviously I was a teacher and I know how kids get really excited when they got things to put on their items, especially the girls, surprisingly the boys too. They get so excited and they take the time to design it. And I used to get my students to design their ideas of what they want to put together. So they would literally draw everything out. And so when I did bring all the items out for them, they were so excited to choose. So, you know, that's why I always bring kids into it because I know how excited they get when they see little things like this. So that will be useful. So, um, yeah, so that's that. Okay. So that's how I use my ribbons for my crafting. I just think it's, it really adds another beautiful touch and I come back to this bag absolutely beautiful all right so let's see what's in the last um bag here right I, Timu I just gotta say you know loving this individual packaging and I know I said that before but I just had to point it out again it is so ideal and it's just it, it just shows it adds more value to the items you're selling that you care about package, packaging it so nicely for us that we care about it more. Okay. And I can already see what's in here. Let's see if it's um, any different. 
I stole because it is one of those little foldable mini iron with a spray. And I did order one of these on my first Timu haul, but I'm looking at it and I can see it is completely different. So I want to see what this one is priced at. So let me show you the box first. And I'm going to get the first one that I actually got from Timu, which is right next to me because I use it for my quilting and do my piecing. As you know, I literally just sit where I am sitting here to do my pieces. This is the first one. And this one is movable all the way around as well. So this is, this is how I use it. And this is your spray bottle here. And you can turn it like that to store it. And it comes in a little tray all right and it sits there and i like to put the point with the point <laughs> and sit it like that and it's got a nice long cord as i'm reaching for it it's got a nice long cord as you can tell i've been using it got thread all over it already but it's beautiful what i love about it is the steam is so nice so i'm hoping this one is just as good the, the amazing thing is it's, it's another green one but isn't this one beautiful i think this one is about 40 something dollars so let's see what price this one comes up as i'm just so loving um timu's stuff i couldn't say it enough <laughs> all right let's have a look and see before i open it i want to know <laughs> i want to know i want to know i want to know what the price is but i know you guys just want to see it okay so you get your instructions oh it's not green <laughs> And it's got the correct plug for Australia. Oh, it's very different. And of course, you get a little spout container. The box is green, but it's not. It is white. Let's take it out and see. Can I see it on the screen? Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, oh my God, it's so cute. That, I almost swore, guys. Oh my God, it's so cute. Oh wee! It's a lot more tinier than the other one. So this is proper portable. I mean, this will be ideal if you're traveling. Wow, look how beautiful it is. I just got to admire it first before I start messing about with it. So you've got your spray. I don't know if you can see the little sprouting spray there, like a little shower. And you've got your area to fill. I would imagine it works the same way. Yes, it does. So you twist it to open it wider so you can actually pour your water in there. I will test it out. Oh, it comes with a little rubber. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> oh my God, this is beautiful. So it sits there. Right, let's have a look and see what this one comes up as. Let me see if it's the same one. Um... It looks the same. Yes, it is the same. So this, I have the white. So this comes in at twenty ninety eight. So it says a, a portable one piece mini steam iron rapid heating foldable steamer with anti slip handle for home and travel. I was right. Beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it's so cute. You know what, these, I just love these for quilting. And you're probably saying I'm gritty. I need to. Yes, I do. I do, I do, I do. <laughs> because, you know, when you're piecing your small little tiny pieces of fabric, you can sit your butt down and just simply iron right where you are. So, so good. So good. I'll bring both of them side by side so you can see the difference. So this one is much bigger and this is much more tinier. So traveling, quilting, traveling, quilting. So either or, <laughs> it depends on, you know, which size you want. A bigger one, a little bit more money, a smaller one, less money. So beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. I love them both. I love them both. I love them both. <laughs> All right, so I guys, I think that was the last item. <laughs> I thought there was more. It would have been so great. All right, but before I go, the most important thing I have to show you is this that we plugged in. Now, 
remember you get your straightener you get your portable USB to plug in and you get your little mat here to store it in so I'm gonna put it on so I was plugged into the laptop and um, this you know as I'm looking at this and I was talking about the caravan I would have loved to have this when we were traveling around I'll tell you why because it plugs into you can plug it into your car because most cars has these things here your USB to actually charge this would be it would have been ideal because then I wouldn't have to wait <coughs> excuse me till I got to um, a power area for us for me to straighten my hair so I'm gonna plug it in once again so that you can see how it works like so just plug it into the laptop because I didn't spend much time on it so when you plug in look it's 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 blinking so obviously the first time I plugged it in it was charged so that's why we had the three so I obviously had it on and I unplugged it and now it's charging now at 70 percent is it 70 or 75 so 75 percent say so 20 percent is already charged at 75 percent so what I'm going to do is unplug it again and see if it actually works so I'm taking it out and so obviously it is it goes back blank so we're going to switch it on I'm going to do it in front of you so let's hope it works yep we have liftoff okay and I reckon that is to take it up to temperature yes it does Ooh. so right now it's blinking at 205 degrees okay so remember, we have the lock and we have the open. So I'm going to close it and lock it, which is good because then your children, if you have, cannot get into it or even pets cannot mess around with it. So I'm going to try it on my hair and see if it actually straightens it. And here we go. I'm going to put it back on there. Right, so I'm going to just scoop down into open it back out let me let me get my timu brush i feel like an advert for timu and uh, this is a detangler brush from my last um timu haul right so that's nice and smooth out so let's see It's warm, definitely. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, the blade itself or the heating pad or the heating stone plate there, it's very small. I don't know if you can pick it up here. It's not very wide. It's not long because obviously here is, is nothing. But that's the plate that I don't want to touch it. I burn my hands. Yeah, that's the plate there. So I'll try it again. The here is not very hard because obviously... It's not, it's still blinking. It hasn't stopped yet, but it is definitely heating the hair. Definitely heating the hair. Let's see if it'll do it hot enough to do a curl under. Yes, <laughs> it does work. Timu, Timu, Timu! <laughs> Look at that! Oh, I love it! <laughs> oh my God! Let's try another piece. Let's try another piece. Let's very, very quickly, guys. Very quickly. All right. Let's brush it out again. All right. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. I'm obviously taking smaller bits. There's no point taking huge bits, and um, you know because the, the the plate itself is small. Now, this is why I said this would have been ideal when I was... Can you see the smoke? Did you just see it? This would have been ideal. And imagine if you're traveling as well. <gasps> it is good! <Canada! laughs> Excellent. I love this. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. It's brilliant. Yep, it is working, guys. It is working. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, if you work in an office and you know your hair is a bit untidy, you know what you got to do. Just you could go to the ladies' toilet 
make sure it's charged in your handbag and you just give yourself a quick tow and you are good to go and it's still blinking it hasn't come up to temperature yet so wow that is brilliant excellent you got other temperatures as well if you're concerned so it goes down to 165 the highest is 205 can you see it moving up this is beautiful guys this is really beautiful how much was this okay let's do a quick price check quick 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 curling iron right let's have a this comes in at supportable right supportable meaning you don't have to do it at home you can have it charged you can do it in the car while your husband's driving and your boyfriend is driving and you're curling your hair on the go now i'm seeing different ones here they have quite a lot of variety but they are ranging from 29 to 30 dollars that's brilliant actually for portable ones because most hair straighteners you got to do that at home isn't it this is brilliant absolutely brilliant well again timu one-stop shop all right guys i am going to wrap this up just want to say thank you so much for staying till the end timu thank you so much for providing these items for me and remember guys i am coming up to 10,000. so don't forget to like share and subscribe and i shall see you in the next timu haul bye for now happy quilting happy shopping on timu love you guys i shall see you in the next one bye for now guys bye